Today we're gonna be cutting this freaking shirt. Have you ever questioned your existence of life? Do you want to find your purpose? Have you found your purpose? I think I'm closing in on it. It's to be a performer. In today's video, you will see me get to perform with the one and only Golden Bear. Handle here. He's taken this photo, he's taken that photo. He's a magician, AKA a creative genius. The energies amplifying each other's creativity, you get this magic. So come along. Enjoy today's video, and I also dive into some fashion, high upscale fashion. Cutting the sleeves off my, my gym shirts. So sit back, relax, take your shirt off, cut it into a million pieces. I don't care. Just enjoy your life and notice that you're floating on a planet. Where are we headed, huh? You tell me. Um, after many inquiries, after many photo shoots, after such shredded physiques, the questions have come in. How do you do it? So today I'm going to attempt to show you how to cut the perfect sleeveless shirt. If you came across this video, don't know who I am, figure it out. I'm not gonna spend time. I like the cuts that go here, right? Uh, stay tuned, by the way. These, this is this is getting old news, by the way. We're gonna make Dunk Life freaking sick gear. So if you see any of my, I'm a fashionista. The weird hoodies with the nips showing, all of it. I'm gonna make a whole line of Dunk Life fashion, but it's for the gym, gym fashion. Gym shin? <laughs> I'm gonna cut it because I'm gonna have a dunk, sh dunk shot, dunk, dunk shoot with the one and only Golden Bear today. Just hit me up. I was gonna run to the beach, get some photos for my new brand shoot. I'm the sun now. I'm the sun, so I need a new brand shoot. I'm like. Black and gold is kind of the new theme. I'm like, this is the perfect shirt. Let's do it. Problem is, uh, I don't have my scissors. There is actually some technique. I've been doing it for years. And the thing I've learned is, just like a haircut, you could always go more. That's where you start and you just go down. But if you cut too far in, then you're like freaking wearing a, you want it right on the edge of the nip. That's the game we're playing. That's the balance, okay? I'm actually okay with it going all the way down. I have another shirt, the Be Limitless shirt, that is just, I from taking it off, I kind of stretch it out and it freaking is open all the way to the bottom, which is not ideal, like all the way to here, but that's okay too. It's more about the cut that you do here. Start small. We're like building a freaking dunk journey. Okay, there's not really much to this. <laughs> Don't underestimate the freaking shreds. If you have shreds, you can cut it freaking down the middle. If you have friends, which I don't have on hand at the moment, um, it's a lot easier if someone does that. So I might actually use this, shout out Scott Jeffries, the artist, as a little weight. So just start out here, obviously not there. I usually, I mean, I'm gambling a little bit. And then you want to go to about here, but then you you want it to try to go natural. All right, so I'm trying to get this seam right on the side so it's even, it's kind of hard. And also I don't care enough I'm cutting my shirt so it doesn't have to be perfect. Maybe that's why I do so well at it, because I let it go, baby. Leave it to the universe to decide. The more in you go, the more nip will show, and you could quote me on that. Okay, so the scissor works. I had a scary moment for a second. See, I'm already going a little too much in. <laughs> oh well, this is the tricky part. Really not much to it. You're just cutting the sleeves. Watch this video get a million views. My goodness. You don't want it to bunch up as you cut because it'll make like frills. All right, so I may have gone a little too much in here, but that's okay. You gotta own the nip. If you're cutting the sleeves off, own the nip. You try to get it equal as well, equidistant. Equidistance, equilibrium, and um, equivalence. And then you'll be friggin' gender neutral. A good scissor would help. Try to make them even on both sides. And the main thing is really, just focus when you're cutting, because I got focused on this side, too much cutting, that I, I went a little too in. So test number one. All right, first test, let's see. I almost forgot about the back. I almost cut the believe in yourself. All right, so this is perfect. Okay, perfect right there. Here, just go, I kind of want it like, like that. And then I, I, in the mirror, I can't see my shoulders. This shoulder feels nice. You're gonna get that freaking, again, don't underestimate this. this one. You don't want to be like this. What are we, in the, in the 70s? What are, I don't know, maybe this, you know, you want that shoulder. Right in the crevice of that thing, now you're cooking. I guess this is Dunk Tip Tuesday, I don't even know. Okay, ooh, not bad. Okay, so this one's really smooth. Yeah, if I come in like half an inch more, I might actually leave this side. I cut a little bit here, just you know, a little bit more. But yeah, this, if this was a little bit more like that, that's nice, this a little bit more like that. This is how you tailor the shirts. So they're, they're custom tailored. So if you want me to custom tailor it, I'll do it for $3,000. All right, so I actually just looked in the mirror again. This side's almost perfect. I might just leave it. But remember that, it starts to just like naturally have that curl because it's just, I don't know, that's how cotton works. It's pretty simple, I'm freaking huge, I'm huge. I'm gonna do a little bit more on this right here, just cut this little tiny piece thing. 
Just like that, look at that. I like how I'm really acting like this is professional. Okay, that's a little too much, Jesus. Hey guys. Very well done, very well done. And that's basically it. You gotta go freaking dunk. You can wear whatever you want if you're flying. And look, when you push your arms like this, it's easy to stretch those cuts you just made. So remember that too, it's gonna get stretched out a little bit. Unless you're, I'm not gonna be so gingerly with this. All right, anyway, dunk life shirts are on my website, by the way. You want the black one? I'll get you the black one. Oh, I don't like that, but it curls under. How we feel? Mirror check. Dunction. And that's good enough, dude. I mean, like, uh, let me find my purple shirt. That might be my best one ever. The, ni the nips are really out, so, but wait. But it does cover it enough. I guess it doesn't at all. Look, it's like one at a time. <laughs> so I might actually cut that one more because I like how crazy it looks. Nice, smooth curve right on the nip edge, dude. But this is definitely like the beach. I don't, I'm not really wearing this to, to I do wear it to the gym, but my gym's basically outdoors. That one's almost like cut off enough and, and tucked under here like this where I can wear it as a sleeveless. It's more like that, which is a really good analogy. This one's more like for letting it fly. And I want to fly in that one, so I might let it fly. And that, okay, hold on. And that leads me to the conclusion. You gotta let it fly. Have fun with it. Start small, build up. I don't even know why I need a conclusion for this video, but hope that was helpful. Hopefully you freaking cut the sleeves off. Get yourself a dunk life tee. Represent the limitless family. What is that? That's us. That's what people believe in no limits. We dunk to express that we have no limits. And that's it. Came out pretty good. I'm gonna cut more. Yo, absolutely immaculate day. A little chilly here in Florida. Going to meet the one and only Golden Bear at the Fort Lauderdale Beach Court. I got some photos there last time. We shall see. Wasn't planning on a dunk day, but you gotta stay ready. This is a really impactful moment, but the wind was too strong. I had such a hard time letting go. I want to make the best YouTube videos I can. I want to make the best business I can. I didn't know what to do. My boy Brian hits me up to go dunk, get these photos. It wasn't even about me. It was about his project. And I said yes without thinking because it brought me joy. And when I got there, the freedom I felt led to more ideas. And not only that, the bonus of capturing the photo. So this is a reminder that whatever you're doing, let go and go with the flow. And that's not as easy as it says. It's not just letting go and doing nothing. It's understanding you're doing things for the joy of being alive and being human. So that's the message I felt. I was in that energy and you only feel that gratitude and that joy once you let go and you act in that faith. So back to the pro back to the dunks. Enjoy. Been out here for almost three hours. Brian's taking time lapse is insane. He's making insane projects with kind of behind the scenes. But you guys gotta check out his time lapse when that video drops. Maybe he'll give me a sneak peek here. But I'm gonna try and throw some down. Let's go. off but the mental training as well because we had to stand around for a few hours for the right light and just wait for the time lapses and I can tap into the energy at any point to start going hard anytime I want and also last time I was here I was just happy to get one dunk I could barely touch the rim I was not in a good place training now warming up felt great just getting warm right now and already getting way above the rim feeling really good let's ride so if it has to be more familiar to get the shirt
all day. Got the winner, baby. Did pretty good on that one. Let's Ready go. to see it? Jesus! <laughs> oh my God! You gotta make it or it doesn't count. Let's go! It's windy. It's sandy. But we have no limits. <laughs> it's stuck it in it counts. Oh, oh my god, I missed. I still got more. Oh, come on! Not like me. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Hey, yeah, let him know, let him know, though. Yeah, don't like me. Yeah, believe. That's it. Don't like You seen that, man. Y'all seen that, man. Stay tuned for high-level videos, professionally produced raps, podcasts, interviews, documentaries, comedic skits with clones, and all types of cool medias. Celebrate every day. Really tune into why aren't you going for your dream? I'm not saying do something drastic, but I am saying take a moment with your beautiful self and think, what could I do? Why am I not doing it? Listen to the fears. Let them surface. Go for it. Just go for it.